All right. Good morning. Good morning, everybody. I hope y'all can hear me. And Let I can know hear if y'all can hear me. Okay, cool, cool, cool. So this one is really about balance, the importance of balance in your life, right? Um, you know, I was able to look at, um, and thank you, Trendon, for giving me the heads up that people were posting um, below the video. Um, that you posted to your channel. And again, just thank you so much, Trendon, for your love and your support. Yes, um, I, I love your spirit, 41. Oh, <laughs> awesome. it, listen, I, I like you say, I feed off of everybody on this channel. And this is really, really the trendy drop. So I, I appreciate everything that you do. Um, I just really wanted to hone in on the importance of recovery, right? So for every workout plan or routine that you have, make sure that you have recovery built into it a rest day of sorts um for those that are christian and you know other faiths even god rested right he, he rested when he was even doing <laughs> when he was even creating this world right so that means that you know we also need rest we require rest and um, another good thing that you can do let's say that you want to stay active um active so it's called active recovery and what that means is taking a walk, you know what I mean? Walking just maybe, maybe not for a whole 30 minutes, but even 20 minutes, right? Um, if you do yoga, if you do Tai Chi, if you do uh, Pilates, even though actually I believe Pilates is a full workout for me, um, you know, these are just active uh, recovery types that you can do. The, the other thing is knowing your body knowing if your knee begins to hurt while you're doing a workout that nest that means that you need to stop don't do it <laughs> don't continue on because you don't want to aggravate an injury right um you know as, as the days go along we're going to really focus on proper uh workouts how you actually do the workout so that you won't injure yourself that you won't injure your back that you won't injure your knees that you won't injure your ankles whatever it is or your shoulders we want to make sure that you're actually doing it and having proper form so that you won't aggravate something on your body so yeah one thing is rest rest is important so for those that, that, that did that workout yesterday you might want to rest maybe every other day you do a workout for 30 minutes to get your heart rate rate up um but yeah it, you know, good recovery, um, rest days are great. Um, and make sure that you listen to your body. If your your body, if you listen hard enough, you're going to know that you need to drink more water. You're going to you're going to know that you need to eat some green leafy vegetables. You are going to know if you really listen to it. Right. Oh, thank you, Pinky the housewife. You are my favorite housewife, to be honest. <laughs> but that being said, um. It, make sure that you have that balance in your life. Get out, get some sun, stretch, do different things that make you feel good. If you like getting your nails done, feet done, whatever it is, get that done. Do those things that make you feel, that, that unplug, I'm trying to say, unplug. Yes, we're on the internet a lot. We are a virtual trendy tribe. However, you got to unplug some time and get to know what's going on outside of this virtual world. Make sure that you get your heart rate up 30 minutes a day. Listen to your body. If, if there's something that's not function, functioning the way it should, get go to the doctor. Go to the doctor. Please get that, get that help that you need by professionals that have been trained, right? And that being said, that's just balance. Balance and rest and water. <laughs> That's the focus of today's 45 uh, minutes with Fit. I pray that you're blessed by this. I'm blessed by all of you. And let's just be in this journey together. All right. God bless you all.